I got a 120 gallon fish tank at a really good price because it came with fish in it. And I was like, oh, well I've got a 230 gallon I can put these big silver dollars and these these Oscars in. And then I get home and I'm going to pull my angelfish out and move them to a different tank and those brats had laid eggs up the entire filter intake. Get out of my picture. So I moved my veil. Do I have the light on in this thing? There we go. I moved my veil. I lost one of them. My boyfriend likes to feed these guys too much and he overfed the tank and so I lost one. Not to I love him, but he tends to feed them while he's on the phone. So I lost one veil. I have all my babies from the other one. And I have this breeding pair that likes to lay eggs at the worst possible time. And of course I can't take the filter intake off of there. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet. Yeah. So the guy had some Oscars and some big silver dollars and I said, hey, I got a big 230 gallon tank they can go into. If you want to sell me the 125 or it's 120 or whatever it is because I have more... I have some super exciting goldfish coming next week and um, so I picked up two 120s but yeah uh, my one veil is in a 55 and these guys were supposed to go in the 55 and while I was gone picking up the tanks and the Oscars they laid eggs so so far everybody's leaving them alone and it'll have to ride the night out while I figure out if I'm just going to scrap these eggs. If I'm going to move the filter intake and see if I can cap the top back on it or what I'm going to do. That was not nice. One more day. You couldn't wait one more day.